In the video for today, I'm going to show you how to increase the virtual RAM for a Windows 10 or a Windows 11 PC as recommended by Microsoft so that your laptop starts performing better while you're playing games on it or while you're watching videos or whatever it is. So sometimes what happens is that when you're playing games on your laptop or when you're using a specific application, your laptop hangs. I mean, when you're playing the game, for instance, you're trying to shoot a specific target. The bullet is not going. It's taking some time for the bullet to go and hit the target. Or if you minimize the application that you're trying to use, it doesn't open anymore. So these are all performance issues on your Windows laptop. And in order for you to fix it, you need to boost your RAM in a way that your laptop is not affected. So the best way to boost your RAM is to increase the virtual memory so that applications work properly on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 laptop. And how to do it is very simple. As you could see on my laptop, if I do a right click, go to system, click on storage, click on show more categories, click on system and reserved. You could see that I have a reserve storage of 5.46 GB. Okay, and uh, virtual memory is boosted up to 1.75 GB. So I'm going to boost this so that I can use apps or play games on my laptop without any lags or without my laptop hanging and all these things. So in order for you to do that, you go ahead and do a search for advanced system settings. Okay, so you click on that option, you get a pop up menu like this, you have various options out here, computer name, hardware, advanced system protection, remote, just skip everything else. Under advanced, click on performance settings, click on this tab. And then you get a pop up menu like this, do not change anything out here. Click on advanced again out here. And then under virtual memory, click on change. As you could see, my virtual memory was automatically managed by my computer itself. So I'm going to change this and manually set this up so that I have a higher virtual memory on my PC. You could do the same. So just uncheck this, ensure that this is selected to C drive, click on custom size. So in order for you to get this value, all you have to do is enter the amount of RAM that you have. Since I have 12 GB, I'll put in 12 GB into one MB, which in kilobytes, which is one zero two four which is equal to 1 MB into 1.5. Now, 1.5 is the minimum value that you could enter out here. Okay, so what you're going to do here is the amount of RAM that you have, maybe 8 GB or 6 GB, just put in that number. If it is 8 GB, you put in 8. If it is 6 GB, you put in 6 into 1024 into 1 1.5. Whatever amount you're getting out here, you could copy it or you could enter it out here as it is okay so you could remove the comma okay and then the maximum size is uh, going to be two times this amount into two which is 36864 so you copy this and you paste it out here or you could just enter remove the comma of course if you are copying it once you enter the value click on set and then click on ok you could click on that apply button click on ok and restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, your RAM is going to be boosted virtually and you're going to find a better performing computer. So after you set this up, the next time you're playing games or you're, you know, using any other applications, you're not going to face any kind of a problem. If this worked for you, please let me know in the comment section below, or you could even send me an email. I'll be happy to respond to you. And if it didn't, please also let me know so that uh, I can find a different fix for your laptop brand and uh, I can help you accordingly. Give my video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. Take care my friend.